camera almost fell out of my helmet. I got my Easy Pass Velcro on my uh, on the edge of my the brim of my helmet and the uh, bottom of the camera, and um, I just opened up my visor and it just kind of like plopped right out. Anyway, I wanted to make a little tribute video. You know, it's not it's not the best. I wanted to have my American flags in here, but. I just wanted to say uh, thank you to everybody who has served in the military. You know, I don't really care where you served. It doesn't really matter. I mean, it takes a lot of uh, cojones, if you will, to do it. A lot of buddies of mine are over in uh, Iraq, Afghanistan. And if they're not yet, they're going. And they're, uh, they're you know, they're, they're fighting for our country. And I, you know, really, I mean... I think that cops, firemen, military personnel, all that crap, got boned. Hey, there you go. I got. Oh, I didn't get. Bo I got unboned. Check that out, yo. I just got unboned. Um, all these people, like for real, I think that they should be getting paid as much as football, baseball, you know, hockey, soccer, all those, all those sports that these guys are making. I think A Rod's gonna finish up with some some amount of billion dollars. That is, that, that's insane. You know, and he's not risking his life for every day. For guys, for, geez, man, the guy's hitting baseball. This guy's having fun, you know, he's playing a game. Sure, it's entertaining. I mean, actually, I, I don't like baseball at all, but it's entertaining to some people. But uh, we don't need them. It's not necessary. You know, you need a military. You need a fire department. You need a police department. I mean, I actually like the cops a little bit better than the firemen because... Uh, you know, cops are constantly on the road. I mean, they eat like... They eat like crap. You know, they got... Oh, man. Zing with a bug. You know, they, they don't have a place to sleep. You know, really, I mean, like, when they're working overnights, uh, which is like an 18-hour shift, which everybody has to do usually every three days, um, they don't have anywhere to sleep. They don't have any, any meals to eat, you know? They have to order food, and that's it. The fire department has a, a bed to sleep in. You know, they have... Uh, they have meals made for them, literally, I mean, they got like, they have someone there that makes the meals, and if not, they make them themselves, they have full kitchen and all that other crap. Are you an idiot? I hate asking, are you an idiot, because I don't know anyone who would actually say yes, but in this instance, I had to. Um, so I mean, like, I feel, I'm a little more, uh, persuaded about the police officers because of all the work that they do, and then they're really always on call, I mean, if you're a fireman and you're uh, you're off duty, there's nothing really you can do, you know, unless you got a freaking hose with you or something. But the cops are constantly on duty, you know. Like there's there's no excuse for a cop not to step in, um, and uh, and protect the people all the time. So this little tribute video is basically uh, thank you to anybody who served in the military. Um, I, I was gonna do that myself, but. I'm not a fan of certain things that are going on nowadays. I'm not going to get too political, but anyway. So, uh, so I'm not serving. But a lot of my friends are, and a lot of them are over in Afghanistan, Iraq, like I said. And uh, it's a real tough time. You know, and a, a lot of people come back a little messed up, or actually a lot messed up. And uh, I think that a lot more should be done for them. So, the least I could do is say thank you for letting me be able to ride my motorcycle like this. I want to say thank you to the police officers, although I hate seeing you guys on the road because I don't want to get a ticket and sometimes I like to hit the throttle. You know, I, uh, I want to say thank you for putting your life on the line every day in most parts of the country. I don't know, some places are kind of lame, <laughs> but it's still, it's still work and it ain't easy and I recognize that. And uh, thirdly, he's a fireman. I mean, there's no doubt about it. I mean, I, I know, in my opinion, you guys have it a little easier than the police officers because of the whole, uh, you know, you, you're really never going to be shot at. You're really never, I mean, on call 24-7, you're really not, like, roughing it. But it does take a lot of courage to go into a building that's burning and try to save someone's life. So, uh, I mean, I, I, there's no, no one can take that away from firemen. Like, that is... That's cool, you know, I mean, that's it's very respectable. And I'm not dissing a fireman in any way, don't get me wrong. I'm not, you know, because my house going on fire, oh my God, this is like light central. 
my house caught on fire, you don't right to be calling a fire department. But, um, you know, I just think that they have it a little easier than the cops on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, and a lot of times the policemen, actually all the time, policemen are, are first at the scene of fires and stuff. But that being said, that's all I wanted to talk about. I just wanted to say, it's basically a thank you video to everybody. And, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm sorry that we can't repay you better. And as... And by we, I mean, you know, the, per the public. <clears throat> you guys get paid like crap. That's not right. But anyway... Alright y'all, I'm making mad boring videos, I don't know why, I, I got no topics, so uh, actually I got a couple emails of topics, maybe I'll do that tonight or tomorrow. Alright, signing out, it's your man, we missed him on occasion. Beautiful day here in uh, New York, gonna continue, oh, gonna continue riding shortly. And uh, everybody, get out, you know. Enjoy the day. Enjoy the summer. Enjoy the warm weather. If you have warm weather, anyway. You know, don't make excuses why you can't ride. Get out there. Mother trucker. All right. You guys want to get signing out.